So what happened? Did you just pick up the phone and call? Yeah, I just decided to give it a shot. Um, I'd been talking with his team for a while, and it came to a dead end, so I gave it a shot. Were you surprised he answered? I was shocked he answered. Yeah. I'm surprised he spoke considering what's happening to anyone on the phone regarding this situation. Well, not only was I surprised he spoke at all, I was surprised that in the way in which he spoke, he, he seemed like there was absolutely nothing wrong. Okay. Here's a clip from your interview. So some are saying that he was possibly pulling the race card here, trying to get Shane Black media into supporting him. Did you get that feeling? No, not at all. I, I've heard that. Uh, he was speaking to a black reporter who, who happens to write for black media. And so I believe that it was a situation where if he was speaking to a white reporter for mainstream media, it would have been a similar message, but delivered in obviously a different way. Okay, you asked him how his wife was holding up under the pressure. Here's what he said. He's really been accused by dozens of women now. How did that, his response, strike you? It was surprising, it, he, especially, again, in the tone in which he gave it. He was so passionate about this, and he was, he was so upbeat about it. Mm -hmm. It was so, it rolled off his tongue. It was as if nothing is going on. Mm -hmm. These allegations don't exist. 